If you want to make an app but don't know coding then this video is for you. Before we start, please subscribe to our channel and hit the bell notification icon. My site makes app development easy. Build premium native mobile apps for both Android and iOS without writing a single line of code. Now you have to create your account before using this online tool. This is the first step towards creating your mobile app. Enter the URL of the website that you want to create an app for. You will not proceed further unless the website URL has been verified. Select WordPress as the CMS platform on which your website runs. Turn on the toggle if you use the WooCommerce plugin to manage an online store on your WordPress website. Enter the name of your mobile application. You can change the app name later from the app settings screen. Once you create an app my site account, you can get started with designing your app. The first step is creating an icon for your mobile app. The first step is creating an icon for your mobile app. You can create an icon by either designing it with the tools available or uploading your own pre-made design. Click on Save to save changes. In this step, you will see how to design a launch screen for your mobile app. Click on Select Background Image and you will be redirected to the image gallery. Enter a relevant search term and browse until you find the right image for your background. If you have your own image then click on Upload Image and select your image and select Done. Make sure the image file size should be 1242 by 2208 pixel and PNG format. Now design your brand logo from here. You can add text, change color, select font and adjust font size. Again, you can upload your own logo. For this purpose click on Upload and select your logo. You can align your logo top, center, and bottom. Now click on Next. In this step, you can design your login, sign up, and forgot password screen. Process is simple and similar to the previous step. Select the background image from the gallery, or you can upload your own. Or you can select the background color. Set your logo and align it. Set your welcome text. You can change your social media buttons. You can adjust the color scheme like button color, button text color etc. Now click on next. In this step, you will make the style of your mobile app layout. You can design your app header and also buttons. Click on Save to save settings. From Home screen you can select and design sections for your app home screen. The main banner is displayed on the header of your home screen. You can select a banner image from here. You can upload your own image, but remember the minimum size is 1125 x 480 pixels. You can select a solid color. You can set text and other settings from here. Blog categories is another important section. You can select the number of columns from here. You can change their shapes.
You can also set background color, text color. From show categories, you can select the blog categories that you'd like to showcase on the app home screen. Select the order in which the blog categories are sorted on the home screen. You can sort the blog categories in alphabetical order or based on the number of posts in each category. To connect your website and app, you need to install the App My Site plugin on your website. You can either download the plugin from App My Site's official WordPress page or install the plugin directly on your website. Once you've installed the plugin, you can verify the plugin installation. WordPress application passwords enable website owners to generate a unique token in order to authorize a REST API request. Using application passwords, you can authorize third-party applications to make REST API requests from your website. Now click on Verify. Now troubleshoot the connectivity between your website and app to identify any issues. Everything is fine now. Now go to the monitor setting and adjust how frequently you would like your app connectivity checked. They will notify you in the event of a connectivity failure. Now let's go to the settings tab to adjust settings. On the general settings screen, you can add or update the details of your website and mobile app. The menu settings screen will enable you to customize the menu you want to display on your app. This will be displayed as a side menu on your mobile app. You can either create your own menu on App My Site or import a menu from your website. From bottom bar you can configure your bottom navigation. Choose what to display on the bottom of your app. This section enables you to configure user settings on your mobile app. The post settings section enables you to control how the posts appear within your mobile app. You can choose to show the page screens of your app in either native or web view. The social settings screen enables you to add your social media handles to the app. Finally, you can preview your app on the live emulator or test it on your mobile device. You can preview your app on App My Site's demo app available on the Google Play Store. This is an amazing tool for digital agencies, bloggers, freelancers, and business owners, etc. Hope you like this video, purchase link is mentioned in description, go get your app now. Please also subscribe to this channel and also press the bell notification icon for more videos.